Idaho Wrecker Sales decided to build a tow truck for the annual Western States Tow Show, which was making its triumphant return to the biggest little city in the world in Reno, Nevada. As the show was quickly approaching, with only 10 days left before the show, we went to work. Waiting to make a huge impression at the show, we concepted this truck as a rugged four-wheel drive mountain recovery vehicle. As possibly the only existing 4x4 carrier on planet Earth, this thing had to be impressive. Starting with a Freightliner M2 chassis, we began prepping the frame and the subframe and running additional wiring for lights. We did the same for the hydraulic lines that would be needed for the final build. Once the chassis was prepped and cleaned, we dropped the subframe, welded it to the truck frame and added some additional touches, like mud flaps, control levers, and ensured that all of our connections were solid. After securing the subframe, we greased all the slides and mounted the deck. Oftentimes, this step can be one of the most difficult, but once you get everything right and lined up correctly, the deck just eases into place. Committed to keeping our workspace clean and organized, we drove the show truck over to the wash bay and gave it a good scrubbing after every step. After pinning the deck into place, we added the SP9000 side puller to maximize this truck's recovery capabilities. Now, even if the car leaves the roadway and ends up face down in the ditch, the operator of this vehicle will be able to recover the car with minimal risk to himself or this truck. And of course, any side puller is only as good as its winch. And the SB9000 side puller we installed on this truck is equipped with a 9,000 pound high drive planetary winch. Spooling winches for a nice tight wrap can be a daunting task, but at IWS we like to have a little fun when we get to that step. While we were at it, we went ahead and spooled the deck winch, which is also a 9,000 pound high drive planetary winch. Now this wouldn't be a show truck if we didn't finish it off with a lot of customized elements, which of course we did. Our engineering team designed the grill of this truck to match its rugged exterior. After approving the final design, the grill was sent off and laser cut from a sheet of stainless steel, then polished and custom fitted to the truck. To complement the grill, we also designed matching side vents, and added a custom Extreme Edition stainless steel mid-step cover to the passenger side. Since we imagine this truck will be operating in the most extreme conditions, we made exterior lighting a top priority. In addition to the custom light bar, we mounted additional lights in the toolboxes. Beneath the underside of the deck, the deck itself, we even went so far as to install lighting in the side rails, which helps illuminate the deck and also acts as additional safety lighting for oncoming traffic. Because we used a wireless contact system, these rails can be removed without messing with any complicated wiring and connectors. In regards to storage capacity, this truck features two in the ditch 70 inch Pro Series toolboxes which provide plenty of space for all your tools and towing equipment. In keeping with our rugged mountaineering theme, this truck features a custom paint job. The hand airbrush mountainscape depicts a variety of wildlife, outdoor vistas and beautiful scenery rendered in an epic smoked gunmetal gray. The inside of this truck is really something special with a hydro dipped carbon fiber textured dashboard, custom switch panel, and an Italian made leather wrapped 18 inch Victor steering wheel. 
With only hours left, we wrapped up the build and headed for Reno, where all of our hard work paid off. Being quite possibly the only 4x4 carrier in existence, our truck was the star of the show, where crowds of enthusiastic towers marveled at its astounding combination of power and beauty. Popular features such as its four-wheel drive capability, robust storage, an array of both safety and work lighting captivated the audience and kept people coming back over and over to get another look at this unique towing vehicle.